Attention, the following video is totally going to kick ass. If you enjoy any of it or have a large <laughs> please click the sub and like button below. Enjoy. Being healthy. Or the win. Sonic is my this way is to swag, This is an intro. Hey YouTube, SZ4 here, and today I'm going to be reacting to another video called Project Shadow 2023, a full short uh, film. Okay, so this is not the official, um, like, official to, like, the Sonic movie story, but someone made this and it fascinated me. I found this through, like, uh, uh, through a channel I was subscribing and they, like, featured it. And then one of them, uh, one of them also reacted to the video. So I decided to react to this. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Watch the original video first. Subscribe to. Okay, I, I don't know. Um, what's his name? Subscribe to. I can't pronounce that. <laughs> well, um, subscribe to my channel down below. Hit that like button. Ring that bell notification. Without further ado, we're going to get started. In three, two, one. Let's go. Ooh. Wow, this is really detailed in a nice way. <clears throat> Why does Shadow's eyelids look so baggy? 50 years ago. Uh, yep. Uh, I knew it. 50 years ago. On Space oh, Colony Hawk. Professor Shadow. Wait a minute. Wait, hold on. Give me a moment. Yeah, sorry about that. I I, I realized there's two. Di there was another version. The one I was watching just now was a different language, but this one's English. I right, we're gonna start. In three, two, one. Let's go. About 50 years ago, on Space Colony Art. Some time ago, Professor Gerald Robotnik was appointed to lead a top secret project at Space Colony Arc, creating the ultimate life form a being that would never age, never get <coughs> sick, and never die. Ooh. So it could fight and defend the United Federation over any of them. But the birth of his granddaughter changed the professor's plans. Maria had an unknown syndrome that prevented her from living on Earth. He needed to develop a cure. Oh. But the government was in a hurry, and he needed to continue on his work for the safety of his granddaughter. Love the artwork, too. To replicate the healing abilities from the ultimate life form was the only solution. With his research, he discovered the Master Emerald. Knew it! Effect of unlimited power. And with the shard of it, replicated the chaos energy and created the chaos drives making amazing creations possible but none that could achieve his goal whoa while in angel island the professor heard a legend about is, a being capable of perfectly channeling chaos energy is that bio lizard and that was the beginning of project shadow oh the professor When he uncovers the secrets of my immortality, you will be healed, and we'll travel to Earth together. Aww. So that was the bile lizard, and he took a shot of the Master Emerald? Wouldn't that, like, damage it a little? But, and then he created seven new, like, what, emeralds? Fascinating. Okay, if, yeah, this is not shown in the film. May, uh, let's just, uh, we'll just consider it as canon, but if, if it, if they show their own version of the movie, then, uh, whatever, I, I, I'll, I have a feeling I'll like this one. Oh, Shadow Smiling, that's weird to see you nowadays. Wow, they did the CGI really good.
Can't get enough of it, huh? Yeah. It's just so beautiful. It looks even better from up close. Yep. The <clears throat> All the war, hunger, and violence that exists down there. We humans can't take care of ourselves. Well, it doesn't matter what happens. We are always trying to find something to destroy one another. Kind of looks like Jim Carrey's grandpa. How is she? She's sleeping now. But only after she made me tell her stories, of course. I'm glad to see that you are getting used to it. <laughs> she likes that you are the one to tuck her in. Because then she can dream about living on Earth. Even if I'd never been down there. Aww. And by the way, what were the test results? Oh, the same as every time. Your DNA is completely chaotic. It's impossible to decode it. So, no progress? Nothing? Nothing yet. Nothing. Hmm. What is that? Is that pizza? I thought you liked Swiss rolls. Oh, shout in his test tube. Ah, you're gazing upon Earth. Oh. Air shoes. Air shoes. To get you all the hey, it's like a reference to Sonic Prime. Lighter, brighter, and way more the, they're air shoes. Start skating to activate the rocket propulsion and run faster than any living being. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like that's a reference to Sonic Prime. The perfect shoes for Shadow the Hedgehog. You really had to make Maria look like Eggman or whatever, like eight, and then you know. <laughs> Picture. Did you really make all of this? Oh yeah, it was an old project from Ark, and well, I improved a little bit here, added a little thing there, but of course! You think I wouldn't make it all myself? A gift is not a gift if not given the right way. <laughs> they are so pretty. Yep. Thank you so much, Professor and Maria. Try them on, Shadow. <clears throat> here we go. <laughs> <laughs> he's skating. I mean, <laughs> he's air ski, air shoeing. Oh, whatever. It's not. It's not skating. Love how to see how. Sh I, I love seeing how sh uh, excited Shadow is. Oh my gosh! Yeah, it's like he's flying a little. That was awesome. Gun! Oh, jeez. Is this a part of his training? What? Are you talking about cute gifts of races around the Ark? I'm pretty sure it's not. This freak should be the country's best defender. Oh, no. Yeah. I know where this is going. It's turning the ultimate life form in a fluffy pet. Well, someone's not enjoying their time watching the ultimate life form. 
You spin around the planet non-stop to infinity. No boundaries. No limits. I don't know. But I would be very happy just to be able to live there. You know what, Maria? Sometimes I feel like I'm trapped on the Ark. To be honest with you, I think I'll never get out of here. Aww. We'll go <coughs> down there. Maybe not today. Maybe not tomorrow. But we will go. I'm sure of that. Maria, I was made with only one purpose. To be the creature that will heal and protect humanity. This is what I was created for. And I am so scared to fail. To be unable to heal humanity. And be unable to save you. <gasps> if I fail, uh -oh. neither of us will get out of here. Whoa. To the professor and What the? Is he? Is it like the Flash where he's like, he's in like a time stop or something? What the hell's happening? Oh no. Huh. What the? Hmm. An alteration in your time perception. Maybe even distortion. For us, it was the blink of an eye. For you, it felt like an eternity. Have you felt like this before, Shadow? When I'm running, yeah, but not this time. I was just talking to her and I didn't get fast. What were you talking about? What does it mean, a time distortion? Mm, to be honest, it is hard to say if it changed how Shadow perceived the time or if he really changed the time itself. It's true, the possibilities are endless with this amount of chaos energy. Yeah. We will need to run some tests on this. What's happening with him, Grandpa? Sick? No, it's impossible. It's something different. So, what is it? Shadow is growing. And he's getting uh, more chaotic than I thought. Chaotic? Uh oh. What is this? He's like teleporting. He is made out of chaos energy, though. <laughs> He's dreaming. After the recent events with the specimen Shadow the Hedgehog at the Space Colony Arc, I have decided to run tests of the development of the this is a high security room, so anything that happens inside should not risk the integrity of the space colony. Shadow, please now point your hand towards one of the targets and try to shoot it from where you are. Shoot it? Oh, is he using guns? Chaos Spear. Hey, focus, Shadow. Shadow, imagine that your energy is moving through your hands. I know you can. Does he get the inhibitor ring? Wait! He need he probably needs to wear those inhibitor rings for him to control his his power. I was not expecting, but I was expecting not 
Every single day, more and more of our soldiers are dying in battle. The specimen is ready to fight. Go! We have no more time. What? Think on how many men will still be here if Robotnik had finally cooperated. Your instructions are clear. Leave no trace. Neutralize anyone at Ark that knows about Project Shadow. Bring the Hedgehog and the Professor to Earth. Oh no! Start the training at once. Neutralize? Yes. Seriously? Allowed to open fire in case of resistance, sir. <laughs> and how do you expect to neutralize the ultimate life form? When you've tested him in the sealed room, did you already know he was able to do that, Grandpa? Well, Shadow is a hedgehog made out of synthetic chaos energy. It's impossible to predict what he could become. But we could imagine yeah. he would be capable of <clears throat> Shadow's body keeps changing between a super hedgehog and a regular one. So that's why you cannot decode it. It's like he's transforming all the time. He is not a regular hedgehog and also not super. That's why he's like this. Precisely, Robotnik. Yes, but it makes decoding him even harder to do. It's <laughs> impossible. Maria, you got it from your. Are always moving uh, around. You got it from your grandfather. And your cousin, too, Eggman. Inhibitor rings. I knew it. You can also call them your one-way ticket to Earth. Inhibitor rings. By keeping the chaos energy in a hold, they will lock your powers and DNA as they are right now. You will not be able to overuse your powers on the first days with these rings. Your body must first adapt to it. But pretty soon, all will be back to normal. If that's my chance to cure Maria, they're like a dream. Thank you, Professor. Yeah, later, I will take a sample of your DNA to assess our progress. Jeez. Doesn't it look closer than it used to? I think so, too. Soon this place will be nothing but a memory of where I used to live and where I met my hero. <laughs> the place I was born and where I got my purpose. Warning. Oh, no. Security breach at the oh, no. You might want to hide. I knew you two would be here. They're looking for you, Shadow. Go to the ejection room at the corridor E1. It was sealed off years ago, and it's the safest place for you now. Hey, Grandpa, what about you? Don't worry about me. I'll be okay. I just need to go to the lab to save some of the files. I'll catch up with you. Oh, boy. Go, go, go. Professor Gerald Robot. Oh, no. Run. We are here to take you and the weapon Shadow the Hedgehog into custody. What do you mean? I complied with the laws. I have done nothing wrong. And Project Shadow is still not complete. I need to save my granddaughter. That was not the deal. We need more time. I think I was not clear enough. You and the Hedgehog will come with us now. That's in order. Now drop the weapon. Hmm. Yeah, not a good idea, pal. Huh? Where is he? Knock him out. I think that I was not clear. Fire! <laughs> He's like, that's nothing. Hey. It's like, yeah, it's like from the game Shadow the Hedgehog, where he did that. Monster. Make him stop, or I will shoot. Surrender! Don't, don't, don't. But what about you, Gerald? Oh yeah, you gotta save the files. 
There's no way the GUN soldier will actually, you know, catch up to the ejection. Oh no, that's Chaos Spear. Like he can stop time. Well, more like him moving super fast. I'm getting the flash vibes, honestly. Nice! How long is... How far is this ejection room? Oh no. Shadow, what's happening to you? It's the rings. The professor told me I couldn't overuse my powers in the beginning. And the problem... <laughs> That I can't take them off anymore, but it's okay. They won't find us in here. I hope not. Where did he go? I can check the cameras. We can't see anything. The not now Tronic corridor has been seeing this bastard. We've been searching for hours now. This freak may have gone invisible, traveled through time, left a ship, or whatever the hell he can do. Wait, look at this. Hmm. Oh no. Shadow. Reacting to a video. Come here, buddy. Let's talk. Oh, jeez. Huh. You know that actually explains why in like in the Sonic X show or the Sonic Adventure Two, where he can't even like. Uh, where? He's here. Where he couldn't fight back to save Maria. Oh no! <gasps> oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. So that's what happened. Maria, be careful. I will be okay. I just wish I could go with you. But, Maria. Promise me, Shadow. Promise you will save them. Be a hero on Earth. Do it for me. Okay. Yes. Yes. I promise, Maria. Uh oh. I hear footsteps. Oh no! Get away from the panel now. Don't play with me. Say it again. Get away. Look, I'll count to three and you will move away. One, two, three. No! You blip. You sh. Wow. You know, these GUN people are. Total bastards, I swear. Damn. Humanity like a real shadow. 
born to heal. Maria. Everything changed at that moment. At those milliseconds, you took everything. Everything we had. I never wanted to hurt anyone. And that, she, that jail talking? She was just a kid. Without his purpose, now he is sleeping. But someday he will wake up. Oh, that's his diary. We'll fill the world with darkness. Shadow will bring total destruction. Dang. That was a great fan-made movie. Oh, Black Doom was featured? I didn't see Black Doom at all. I'm gonna rewind it once it's over. At least uh, we got more depth in what happened like with Shadow. Like, you know in Sonic X where he's like, I try to stop him, but there are too many to stop. Uh, there were too many to stop. Well, at least we actually see what really happened that day. I mean, we saw Shadow the Hedgehog a video game clips of Maria's death, but I I don't know it. But now we actually see uh uh we uh, we actually see more uh, what really happened. Yeah, that was awesome. Is there like a post credit scene? Present day. Oh, here we are. Oh, boy. Oh. Black Doom! Wow. That's amazing. I hope you enjoyed the reaction video of Project Shadow. Man, that was a sad film. But it's a good one too. Like I said, they can't show that in the movie, but they do mention Maria and Gerald. This is considered to be canon. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you all later. Peace. Stay healthy for the win.